Peter has an intuitive sense of what's going on around him. He knows how to read people. He knows to anticipate something that's, that what's really happening in the room, but others may not realize it. He was ebullient. He was smart. He was direct. Peter was good at his job because he was so thorough in his preparation and his analysis, but in the end so realistic in terms of the expectations that might be a fair relationship between a major tenant and a developer landlord. He initiated and promulgated the profession of tenant representation. It did not exist here when Peter arrived. And let me tell you, it was a tough road because many, many owners said, are you kidding me? I'm gonna pay you to represent a tenant who's and negotiating against me? Where, what country are you in? It was a brand new business, a brand new concept. And Peter was, was so good at, at salesmanship. Peter set the standard for the tenant representative broker profession in the greater Washington, D.C. area. It started with Peter Spire. He's the guy that made our careers. He taught us the finer things in life, like get the swimming pool, buy the car, wine. Oh, Peter it loves wine and food. He taught us how to go to the best restaurants. He, he was just, and he, he was a lot of fun at doing that. There was never a serious meeting. It was always somebody laughing or making some kind of a joke or a crack or something like that. And Peter was right there. He, he, he was one of the leaders of that pack. And it was just, it was fun. It was a fun place to work, in spite of how competitive it was. And at Studley, it was competitive. Uh, but having to manage a, a lot of brokers uh, in a positive way that kept them from, you know, shooting each other, it's hard to do. And Peter somehow did it just by the force of his personality. Peter has left such a mark with Savile Studley because over the years, the people that he worked with are almost all still there, and every one an absolute professional in their own right. All that came along uh, working with people and then with the support of Peter. I don't know what else to say about Peter, but I gotta tell you, I owe him a lot, and I think we all owe him a lot. The industry owes him a lot, and I'm glad to see we're recognizing him, really glad.